Hello, I hope you're doing fine, I hope you're doing wonderful, I hope you're just going. Please, before I start, like, if you like, share, and subscribe. This is a gold brief after a very, very, very tough day in the stock market today. And after the FOM, FOMC meeting, uh, this is, we're going to start with Euro USD pair. And you can see that uh, disco formation or the pipe formation is still intact. Where, where the, uh, the Bollinger Band is, is, uh, is tightening. And also it, it's still forming a, a higher low so far. And uh, it did resolve that continuation pattern. So it, uh, it became like two uh bull flags now we're forming the second bull flag right now and the macd is still intact and also you have a, a, an inverted hammer and a, a and another rejection from the lower bollinger band and a semi definitely a bear trap and you closing above the 20 day moving average and you form in a bullish engulfing in uh, the daily time frame and what else bullish macd is still intact what else beautiful a beautiful uh let me get rid of the bullish macd so i can a beautiful uh bullish uh divergence between here you have a low a lower low in the price action and now you have a low and a higher low in the RSI, which is extremely, extremely uh, reliable. And you closed above the 20 day moving average. This confirmation will be in effect once you pass this 50. You have now uh, the bullish MACD, which is extremely important in that formation. And you have an RSI going toward the 50 uh, level. Let's look at stochastic as well. What a, what a long day, what a long day it was, golly. Stochastic is, is now trying to form a bullish uh, position you're still in the bearish now, but the, it's hooking up. So it didn't give me any information. The stochastic, that is. Yet, it is extremely important to have bullish rami slash hammer slash uh, bear trap slash uh, bullish divergence and the formation of the disco formation. Once you get over that, it's going to be a very fast move. So I'm very bullish on the Euro USD and it gave us a bullish view after a very long day. Remember, closing over the 20 day moving average always, always, always bullish. Okay, let's look at silver. All right, another, another beautiful, 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 uh, Bounce, beautiful hammer slash bullish harami right here. Came from an older price memory by the penny. And a very close uh, bullish MACD. And what, what do I love the most? I love, I love the bullish divergence. Not only that, you missed the oversold since the start of the sell-off, 2nd of December. You've been having higher lows, lower, lower lows. And also, if you remember my RSI uh, rule, because we tagged this over, that's why, if you remember, I was really hesitant to call silver bottom because I, I said back then stockchart.com did not register an, uh, uh, an RSI below 30 yet 
uh, other platforms did, including this one, TradingView. So that means we must visit that low. It's, it, isn't that amazing? Isn't that amazing? It never ceased to amaze me, that thing that I discovered. And I'm happy that people would, would know about it and share it. So, okay. I think the bottom is in. I really, really, really believe it through and through. Okay. Let's look at the four-hour time frame to see if the bullish MACD is in a bullish mode. It's close. It's very close. Very close. Two hours should be. Two hours is, is in uh, the bullish MACD. But oh well. Uh, so silver has bottomed. Let's look at gold, the mighty gold. All right. Another beautiful, beautiful, beautiful uh, bear trap right here. This is, okay, uh, definitely a bear trap. This is a, a left shoulder, head, right shoulder. You went below the left short, the shoulder. You trapped some bears and you made a hammer with a bullish uh, harami slash bullish, bullish harami. Usually from failed moves comes fast moves. To the other direction so we did uh, traps and bears and the bearishness was really really obvious in the market and he trapped those bears now okay so bear trap hammer bullish rami the macd is very very close to have its bullish mount and we know what happens every time it gets in a bullish mode. Price expansion to the upside. So what's going for gold now? Bear trap, bullish uh, harami slash hammer, beautiful price expansion to the upside. And did we forget something? Yes, we did. Beautiful, man, beautiful, beautiful RSI bullish divergence amazing you would see you would see how, how accurate it is so why gold did not visit this low because we, we we've been missing uh, the oversold in the RSI since August so this is the bottom and definitely it's still intact okay but Silva did not do the same reaction with the RSI. You know why I love the RSI now, huh? <laughs> okay, good. So Silva is bottomed. Gold is bottomed now with a bear trap from this failed head and shoulder. Let me look at a Newmont. If I'm bullish on Newmont, I'm bullish on uh, at the gold miners sector. There's definitely something wrong with Beaumont, Def uh, Beaumont, oh, Texas. There's de definitely something wrong with Newmont. Definitely. Somebody knows something we don't. Yet, I'm not worried about it because once the gold, go, once gold and silver go up, their profit margin go up, no matter what happens in the company, its profit will go up as a result of that. The shares will go up even if somebody knows something we don't know about. So the price behavior today, it hit a price memory to the penny right here, to the penny at 53.16 to the penny. And it goes further, by the way, this, this thing goes further and closed <laughs> in this price memory to the penny as well. And that's something. Okay, let's see how further it goes. This thing right here. Okay. It goes really further. That's the importance. See? See how important it is? And some people doubt technical analysis. See that? To the penny. This is definitely a demand area. Definitely. So we, I might call it first bottom, 
second bottom, triple bottom, quadruple bottom. This is an, a beautiful, beautiful place where always, all the time, the price expand to at least 10% in the past. 100% of the time, 10%, sometimes more, including this one, 10, 10, 10, okay? So am I bullish on New, uh, on Newmont? Absolutely. Maybe somebody knows something we don't know about. All I know about is their profit margin will go up based on the pending rally in British precious metal. So, okay. So uh, this is a volume analysis. So since this bounce, this beautiful morning star that, as I said, it's going to act like support and it did, it closed uh, above it. Uh, the volume, the up volume was uh, over 55 million and the down volume is, is almost 19 million maybe. Which means what? It means accumulation. And every time you have this uh, price collapse with high volume, you have a bounce. You had it right here after the earning, the bad earning in 28th of October. So high, higher volume, then you bottomed and you rallied 10%. And you had it here too. And this is during the first sell off of silver. So you had it, you start having it here. This is not really that high. It gets to 10 million. And that was the bottom, the, the almost only two trading days close below that one and after that you have this rounded bottom then another 10 percent okay so uh, it's it's really really obvious uh, even though newmont is underperforming everything but this bad blood is necessary for for uh, future rallies you had the similar bad blood right here where went down severely it was a bad earning too and after that you went up over 23 percent in a month after okay so am i bullish on newmont absolutely could we have weaknesses in the next couple of days maybe but the more we get rid of the bad blood is the better okay good deal let me look at the rsi We've been missing the um, RSI since September 20th. We missed it all the way till, till this bottom right here. Okay? So this shows accumulation to me all the time. A and it never ceases to amaze me as well. So uh, what's going to happen, Newmont? I really don't know, but it's extremely probable that we bottomed in the euro, silver, gold, and it's extremely probable in the next 10 working days, we're going to have a good rally in gold, silver, and gold miners. Please like if you like, share, subscribe, and do remember, Discord's for a ball!